All right, gamers, welcome back to another epic episode of Modded Minecraft. Since it's now summertime, I thought it would be cool to go to the tropical dimension today. The fuck you talking about, Don? Summer isn't for another 10 days, you idiot. Oh my god, dude, it's basically summer. Nah, uh, it's spring. How about I shove a spring up your ass so you can jump over the wall I built? Whatever, nerd. Anyways, I need some pineapple and the bamboo over here to get to this tropical dimension. Oh, a tropical dimension. That sounds actually pretty dope. How do you get there? You need to drink a pina colada while sitting on a chair during a sunset. Pretty weird way to get there, but all right. By the way, I'm still pissed you turned me upside down last session. My area is a mess thanks to you. It's not my fault you're a dumbass and couldn't figure out that all you had to do was just get rid of the anchor. Yeah, yeah, whatever, bitch. Okay, well, today I'm taking a break from the Twilight Forest, and I'm going to try to make a smeltery from the Tinker's Construct mod. The fuck would you need to tinkle in a smeltery for? Not tinkle, tinker. Oh, well, it sounded like tinkle. You need a fucking hearing aid, nerd. Okay, I got the beach chair. Now I just need to craft a pina colada. Oh, shit, I need to find a coconut. You need to find a lot of things, Don, such as a less orange face. How about you find a more manly wife? Oh, wait, that's not possible. Shut the fuck up, Donald. Okay, so you need pineapples, and what else for the tropical dimension, Don? A beach chair and a coconut for the pina colada. You just have to find a palm tree from the mod that generates in the overworld. Okay. All right, that should be enough sand and gravel for the grout. Is that it? Ah, uh, shit, it's from a different mod. Oh, hey, I think I found it. Yep, there's a coconut up there. Unfortunately, that's not what the doctors said when they were checking your head. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Oh shit, I'm gonna need a lava bucket to even power the smeltery? What do you even need a smeltery for, Barrack? None of your damn business. Damn it, why can't I find a fucking palm tree? Maybe get some glasses, nerd. How long did it take you to find one? I found one pretty quick. Uh, oh my fucking lord. Jesus Christ, why do I keep falling? Maybe you got the Joe Biden disease. Shut up, buttface. I've only fallen down twice today. Oh Jesus, what the fuck? I'm stuck in a spike trap. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked, loser. Oh, shit! Holy shit, was that annoying. God damn it! Wow, dude, that's pretty lame. Shut up, dick face! Shit, I'm gonna need to build a basement so I have somewhere to put the smell tree. This has taken so much longer than I expected. If you're building a basement, make sure to allow Joe in there since he loves hiding in them. Where else am I supposed to go? All my ice cream is down here. Hmm, I wonder if this mining TNT would help mine out a basement for me. Well, what else would a fucking mining TNT do? I don't fucking know. You know what I'm gonna collect these iron spikes for something funny in the future? Okay, cool, whatever, nerd. Just don't put that shit in my house. Bitch, by the time I do anything with these iron spikes, your F-tier memory is not even gonna remember this. That might be true, but I still know how to get back at people. Just look at the epic chance cube prank I pulled on Barrack. Yeah, I'm still extremely fucking pissed about that. My roof is destroyed because of that. Oh, uh, what a shame. Oh, thank God I finally found a fucking palm tree from Tropicraft. Ha, huh, I found that shit a long ass time ago. Speaking of things that were a long ass time ago, you were born closer to Abraham Lincoln's inauguration than your own. The fuck you talking about? Well, Abraham Lincoln was inaugurated 77 years and 261 days before your birthday, and you were 78 years and 61 days old at your own inauguration, making you born closer to Lincoln's second inauguration than yours. Come on, bro. We're supposed to be playing a block game filled with crazy mods. I don't want to think about math. That shit gives me a headache. If you don't like headaches, then why do you eat a shit ton of ice cream every week? Don't you get brain freeze? You can't get brain freeze if you don't have a fucking brain. Ah, that's true. Oh, shut up, you nerds. Hey, my wheat seeds aren't growing. Oh, but my parsnips did. All right, let's see what this mining TNT does. Oh, fuck, it's getting laggy. Okay, now I just gotta wait for the sunset. Do I really have to drink this pina colada the moment the sun sets? Like, how do you know when the time is right? I don't fucking know. Just guesstimate it or some shit. Holy shit. Okay, I was not fucking expecting this. I hope this is the right time to drink this. Let's fucking go! All right, that looks like a sunset to me. Oh shit, my game crashed. I get a better PC, nerd? How about you get a better face? Jesus Christ, I should've just mined out the basement myself rather than use TNT. Hmm, okay, this does look pretty tropical. Let's go, I finally finished the floor to my basement. Even though it looks uglier than Donald, when he wakes up in the morning, it's good enough for my smeltery. At least when I wake up in the morning, I don't shit my pants and make my wife throw up in the bathroom like Joe does. 
Hey, that only happens when I eat a crap ton of ice cream before bed. So every day then? Yeah, pretty much. All right, I got the general smeltery done now. I just got to figure out how to actually put shit in it and then get what I want out of it. Hey, that's what I said when I was with your mom last night. Shut up, Don. All right, I'm finally back in the fucking game. Oh shit, where the hell am I? Oh fuck. Holy shit, that nearly fucking killed me. Oh, so this is the tropical dimension. Oh wow, they added frogs. Oh shit, what? Those stupid motherfucking frogs poisoned me. Hey, wait a minute, wasn't I supposed to spawn here with a portal? Yeah. But there isn't one, how the fuck am I gonna leave this dimension? I don't fucking know. Well, at least this dimension is pretty cool. It's given a lot of summer beach vibes, but I don't want to be stuck here forever. Speaking of which, are you sure you aren't a vampire, Joe? I mean, you literally hide in basements, avoiding the sun, and you're just so damn old. Bro, you're old too, bitch. I'm only four years older than you. Yeah, so what that still means, I'm younger. You're both old farts? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm poisoned again. What the hell is that? What the fuck is that noise? Sounds like Joe's wife when she wakes up. Hey! Oh shit, maybe this was a mistake. God damn it! Okay, I did all the tedious stuff now. This should hopefully work. Oh shit! What the fuck? These tropical creepers spawn flowers when they explode. Damn it, why won't this shit drain into the bucket? I knew this was gonna be fucking complicated. Maybe I need more in there? Yo, Donald, can you send me the cords to the stronghold? Yeah, sure, but why do you want to go to the stronghold? Oh, I don't know. I just want to collect some ender pearls for no reason at all, and that's the best place to collect them. Okay, fine. I'll send you the cords on Discord in a moment. Whoa, what the fuck is this shit? Must be some kind of tropical village. Oh, I think I just found what you found, Joe. Okay, cool, whatever, nerd. Damn, there's nothing in these chests. Just like Joe's head. Hey! Holy shit, this is such an overpowered supply of ender pearls, it's not even funny. But it will be funny later. Oh, thank God, it's finally turning daytime. I was so tired of it being darker than Michelle's butthole. Shut up, fucktard. And speaking of buttholes, yours must be extremely dark from all the residue of shit that comes out of it when you crap your pants. Barrick, it's no surprise that you have an expert opinion on buttholes after all you've been talking out of yours for years. Fuck you. Okay, I'm gonna build a tropical-themed house for this dimension. And I'm gonna use this bamboo for the majority of it. Bruh, you already have a shitty house in the overworld. Why do you need another shitty one? Because I can, and it's not gonna be shitty, unlike your diapers. Shut the fuck up, bitch. No, you! All right, this should definitely be enough. This bamboo house is gonna look epic. Okay, cool, no one asked. Oh, hey, they added fish in the mod. I thought 1.13 added fish into the game. They did, but we're stuck in 1.12 because of these crazy mods. We always could update, but then we'd loose the world, you'd loose your stupid marble house and arcade machines and your guinea pig. Damn. Why won't this shit drain into the fucking bucket? I'm gonna have to watch a stupid tutorial. What the hell are these things? Oh, shit. Okay, this is fucking cursed. Are you fucking kidding me? That only makes one door? Well, at least it looks tropical. How does a door look tropical? It just does. And just hit the faucet. And oh, I needed a faucet field. instead of a pipe. If only Hunter preferred faucets over pipes. And if only you preferred healthy food over McDonald's, then you wouldn't need a new chair every week from breaking them. Shut up, dick face. Oh, hey, a dimensional door. Maybe that could teleport me back into the overworld. But I guess for now, I'll explore this dimension a little bit more before trying to leave. Okay, this better fucking work. Let's fucking go! Holy shit, that volcano is fucking huge. I didn't know your mom joined the server. Shut up, Don. Oh, there's nothing in here. Well, what the hell were you expecting in a volcano? Fucking Narnia or some shit? I don't fucking know. I was hoping for more than just lava. Why don't you jump in there and find out if there's something else down there? Yeah, I'm gonna pass on that idea. Unless I had a fire res potion. All right, I hope I made enough buckets. Oh, shit. Ha, <laughs> ha, perfect. Oh, shit. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, crap. All right, I 
hope this dimensional door shit gets me out of this tropical dimension. All right, please don't fucking send me to a lava trap room. Oh, Jesus, what the fuck? This room is freaking crazy. Where the fuck do I even go? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. I didn't want to land in the fucking water. Knowing this mud, the void is right below this water, and it will send me to that dark-ass nightmare biome. Didn't know your wife was a biome. Oh, for fuck's sake, Don. What the fuck? There's an alien invasion. Should have built a wall to keep him away. God damn it. I knew that was going to happen. Fuck off, you stupid aliens. I'm almost there. God damn it. OK, that's definitely enough damage. Come on, come on, come on. Let's fucking go. Oh, good, another battle castle. Maybe I can get a sky gem again. Let's go. What the hell? Oh, what the fuck is this shit? Barak, what in the fucking hell did you do? Your mom. <laughs> yeah, very funny, bitch. Seriously, though, I got you back for putting a bunch of fucking chance cubes in my house, so I hope you enjoy that blue liquid. Oh, fuck. You the fuck can I get in my house? Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Holy shit, what's happening? God damn it, I hate this game. Oh, shit. This is getting so fucking annoying. Hmm, I wonder what's at the top of this giant ass tree. Wow, is this really it? I feel like I'm looking into Joe's life here, being that this is so lame. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Oh, my fucking Lord. Okay, this is pretty lame. And I will play. Yep. Fucking bitch. Why does this shit keep teleporting me? Cause it's liquid ender. Oh, well, that's stupid. Look who's talking. Oh, wait a minute. I could just get rid of the source block. Oh, there we go. Oh, shit. This shit is so fucking annoying. Shitty fucking testicles. Okay, I'm at a loss for words. Aren't you always, Joe? No, not always, just when I'm tired. Oh, so 24-7. Shut up, you dingus. Jesus Christ, how did you make this so fucking annoying? I was inspired by Don's career. Hey! Fucking hell, you even got this shit around my farm. Two hours later. Okay, I'm finally done getting rid of this shit. I'm gonna take a fucking nap, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Just don't be late like last time. Hey, I couldn't help that I crapped my pants before the recording.